Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, this is Matt Cooney here at Boston Social Media. <clears throat> uh, if you've been following our conversation on geolocation, uh, there's a very interesting article that's been posted today, uh, January 19th. Uh, it's on a variety of different places. It's on MSNBC, CNN Money, uh, Mashable. Uh, but it's regarding Starbucks and their debut of a mobile app that allows, well, it's a feature in its mobile apps that allow users to pay uh, for their drinks using their smartphones. So uh, the app generates a barcode um, that a user can hold to a scanner to pay for, uh, you know, whatever, coffees, muffins, lattes, um, whatever Starbucks sells. So uh, <clears throat> what does this have to do with geolocation, you ask? Good question. Uh, it's my opinion that there, there, will, there's, there will be five stages of evolution to social media. And um, the first two uh, are well underway. But uh, today's story factors into this evolution in a big way. Um, stage one is the development, of course, of proprietary social networks. Uh, so what's really started with MySpace uh, has, is, is well underway in its evolution and is being perfected by networks such as Facebook, uh, YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter, uh, various blogging platforms, and of course, uh, proprietary geolocation networks such as Foursquare, Gowalla, and Yelp. Um, stage two is the rise of mobile devices. Um, so the um, iPad, the iPad um, marks the first real strong transition from a smartphone into a smart, powerful mobile computing device. And this is definitely, in my opinion, uh, the direction things will be headed in. Um, stage three is the utilization and integration of these social networks um, by businesses to feature price and time sensitive promotions. Um, stage four is the integration of e-commerce, and this is key and pertains directly to today's article, um, into the mobile experience. So for lack of a better term, we can, we can refer to this as the mobile economy. Um, CIO, uh, our terrific website uh, has a great white paper on this today. Um, it's about the, the the need for security in mobile devices, and mark my word, this in the, this sub industry uh, will be explosive in the in the coming years. Um, it's entitled "Mobility Without Limits," and there's a link to the PDF at the end of this post. So, stage five, sort of the the grand realization, if you will, is the um, this is social recommendation. And this is basically what Facebook was after with their uh, open social graph um, PR Donnybrook that they went through. Um, this, they, basically, they're going to tell you what your friends like uh, and therefore what they think you'll buy. So basically, what, basically all of this leads to the following scenario. Uh, through your cell phone or your smart mobile device, and it most likely will be the latter, you'll be alerted to a price and time sensitive promotion um, specific to your location. Um, you're, you're going to receive this through uh, a social network or most likely a combination of social networks um, such as the inevitable Foursquare feature on Facebook. Um, and it will tell you that you now have a coupon for a coffee house that's two blocks away from where you're standing at that moment in time. And 27 of your friends like this coffee house or a brand of coffee within this coffee house and um, they, therefore, they recommend it. So this synergy um, of networks across multiple platforms uh, working to achieve one thing, um, getting price and time sensitive promotions to you in a way and at a time that you're most likely to buy or utilize these promotions. Um, though that's the future. Basically, that's the future as I see it. That's the ultimate realization of, of social media marketing and uh, marketing through social networks. So what do you think? Is that accurate? Is it lunacy? Chime in here at Boston Social Media and let us know what you think. We'd love to hear from you. So once again, at the bottom of this post, um, there is a link to an article on today's Starbucks um, press release, and that is on that, that's through our money at CNN.com. And also there's a link to the PDF paper on mobile security. So we hope you enjoy. Thanks again. This is Matt Cooney at Boston Social Media.